I'm going to upset some people with this one too. Familiars in D&D are dumb. These little small creatures that you can summon and then send in as infinite scouts to just go in and die. And then it's fine, they're back. And they summon and then this just, and how are you supposed to connect to a pet that can just die for no reason? And if it's in combat and it does die and there's no emotional connection to it because you can just resummon it back again. And then in combat, it does nothing but take the help action, granting the player advantage on all of their roles. And, and then they don't, usually there's no flavor explanation for anything. And it's, so it's messing with the combat pillar. It's messing with the exploration pillar. And I guess socially, you get to talk to a cool little pet, but that's still not good enough. And the only familiars anyone ever uses are octopus and owls because those are just the best ones because they get the best stats. So everyone min-maxes their familiars to not be custom whatsoever or connected to it whatsoever because of some sort of backstory lore or any sorts of things. So follow for tomorrow where I actually give solutions to all of this.